gonna start with teaching our perch position. So because the robot's already in position, we're gonna drag and drop our perch icon. And then we can drag the robot to the approach position. Then we drag the icon for that movement in. Drag it down to the actual pick position. Drag the next motion icon in place. Re automatically records that point. Tell it here's where we want it to close the gripper. Select gripper two. Tell it to use payload five. Then click in the white space to get back to this. Drag the robot up and away a bit. Drag our icon over to create our depart position. And then I'm just gonna reuse point one for perch. So I can drag any icon here, click on it, and then tell it to reuse point one, as you can see here. And now the program's ready to run. Now that we're done with the pick process, we'll have to do the same thing for the machine. So we'll move to a perch, move into an approach, move to our unload point, close the gripper, nice. back away, flip to the load gripper, load point, open the okay. gripper, back away, back to the machine perch, and then back over to the table for a drop off. So one of the built-in safety features of this system is a contact stop. If it does occur, it's easy to reset. Press the play button, tell it, yes, you're sure you want to keep going, and it starts again.